I think you may have heard this. Lennon once said, there are decades when nothing happens, and then there are weeks when decades happen. That's very well put. And when you're buying businesses, don't, don't call them stocks. When you're buying businesses, when you're buying apartment houses sometimes, when you're buying raw land, you know, all kinds of things. There are times, there's times when you get a chance to act and do something really intelligent. It may, may happen once every 10 years, for once every 20 years. Depends on what field you're in, where you live, what you know, all of that. But While Lenin may have been speaking about events in history, Buffett also sees this happening in personal histories. Most of the important things, there's a lot of foundational work, but the actual big acts in life are when you propose to your spouse. I mean, that, I mean, forget all the other stuff. I mean, if you, if you made the right decision and you get the right answer from he or she, you're 90% of the way home in life. Perhaps Lenin was referring to that week in April 1917. It was during the First World War. He had been exiled for 17 years and was living in Switzerland. Germany was fighting on two fronts, in the east against the Russian Empire and in the west against Britain and France. In February 1917, the Russian Empire crumbled, and the Tsar was deposed. The Germans were eager to get Russia to abandon the Western Front. The Bolsheviks were well organized and opposed imperial wars, but their leader Lenin was in Switzerland. Britain and France were allied with Russia and would never allow a revolutionary such as Lenin to return. So Germany decided to secretly smuggle Lenin into Russia by means of a sealed train that left Zurich on April 9th and reached Petrograd on April 16th. Its purpose was to get Lenin and the Bolsheviks to incite rebellion and chaos in Russia. So Russia would withdraw from the war, collapsing the Eastern Front so Germany could concentrate its firepower on the other two allies, Britain and France. The consequence was the October Revolution later that year and the establishment of the Soviet Union a few years later, thereby changing the world and challenging the capitalist world order. <laughs>